Hey, boys and girls, welcome to another episode of the Tipsy Irishman. I have not had a lot of caffeine today, bear with me. As always, Mr. Chihuahua over here on the uh, on the backside there, keeping an eye on us. And uh, we're just uh, doing a quick Sunday hello. Hope you're doing well. I'm doing okay myself at the moment. <laughs> Cutting down the caffeine. But mentioning caffeine... <laughs> Today's choice is uh, that we're using is grinds, as usual. It's a, a caffeine coffee pouch. Helps you stop smoking you know, or uh, using other tobacco products. Look into it. But it also has caffeine in it. This one is a only a 25%. Uh, we're going low today. We're trying to cut back a little bit. So this is the one I'm using today because I actually did have a little coffee today. Just a little bit. Nice coffee. Don't judge me. Anyways, grinds. Go get them. Go to getgrinds.com and check them out. Tell them the Tipsy Irishman sent you in the comments when you order. Thank you. And now, on with the show. <laughs> Today's lovely uh, guest is this. It is this. Uh, it's a little bright there. It is. It is. This is what the bottle looks like. It's Redwood Empire Lost Monarch. And we have another one that's the uh, uh, same company uh, before the Monarch. And uh, we're going to try that uh, on another day. But we're going to go ahead and jump into this because our great friend Jay Cole dropped it by. So we're going to try it out. Sure. And then also, a lot of people have been telling me, I'm not a big, huge beer guy. I will drink beer when needed. <laughs> when around. Uh, come to your house, that's all you got. I'm, I'm, uh, I'm, I'm willing. But uh, I'm going to try this today. I heard great things. Sorry, the glare is terrible today. Come over here. Carry it. It's a bomb. 5%. 5% malt liquor. Malt liquor. Malt press liquor. <laughs> Sorry. It's a good side joke. But we're going we're gonna to try that after we try this first. <sighs> Let's see how today's going. <clears throat> for you. As always, we go gung-ho here. <laughs> here we go. Oh, that's all right. Straight. Full disclosure, though, I, I always get my samples and we always put them in the fridge. I like, I like my stuff cold. Not always with ice, as you've seen on other shows. But that's what we're going to do. We're going to put that nice and let it mellotate. <laughs> Copyright. <clears throat> it's good. That's good. Straight. All day. Every day. By the way, that the kernel we tried the other day that I went and got, that is gone. <laughs> Told you I was going to get in trouble. Yeah, I got a couple hangovers from that. But I had fun doing it. <laughs> Just I see something weird in there. <laughs> in, the, in the light there. I don't know what that is. Anywho, here we go. Oh, it's even better and nice. Mmm. That is... That is uh, really good. I'll be honest with you, they have a rye, too. I don't remember what it's called, but uh, we'll figure it out for you. And uh, some rise I like. I, there's some rise I will just love to death, and some I cringe. <laughs> Still drink it though. That's good. The only problem with that is I'm upset that I don't have any more. Because <laughs> that's it. Until I go buy some. So if you can find it, you can go buy it. I know where you can get it. If you look around, you'll find it too. Oh, what the hell. It's at a big store that doesn't start with ABC. It's not ABC, but it's a, it's another store. It's not my store, but you can get it. So anyway, let's let's put this over here. Uh, I will tell you this: you've heard me talk about H and H. So, 
should have brought the bottle over here. So if if you want a cheap handle um, uh, at a decent price, um, I have to, I do a daily drinker. I'm a daily drinker, so I drink something that you know all week, and I don't like to spend a lot of money on that. But I want something that doesn't taste like crap either. H and H is amazing in my opinion. It tastes better in my opinion than Buffalo Trace. Sorry, Buffalo. Love you. Anywho, I found it in abundance at uh, the, th the ABC. You can get it from ABC. Yeah, that's where I found it. It's a decent price. It, it, it ranges from uh, $17.99 to $23, just depending, I guess, on the week. Uh, but I've been getting it for about 18 bucks out the door. And it's good. It's a good, it's a good, when you're not drinking your expensive stuff, it's a good um, thing to dry, to drink. It's very good. I like it. That's, that's my main go-to for cheap. <laughs> Let's just say. All right, we're going to crack this bad boy open. Like I said, I'm not a huge beer guy. I can't understand beer, though. You know, I can get the nuances of a beer. But... Ooh, nice and crisp. I know it's a new shocker, but it smells like beer. <laughs> All right, ready? We're going to do this. We're going to do this. Here we go. That's all right. Um, if I was comparing it to anything, it's super uh, barley -y. It's super beery. Um, it'd be great to do a you know a bomb in there, maybe throw a little whiskey. Or uh, my friend of mine at work, uh, he gets it and he does um, he does kamikaze bombs. He uses this with um, oh, what's it called? Sake. Sake. He puts sake bomb. He puts sake shots in his beer. And uh, that could be tasty. I'm not a big sake fan either, but um, it's very beery. I don't, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know how else to explain it. If I can compare it to something, um, it's got a rich flavor, uh, kind of like uh, Foster's uh, Green Can, the premium Green Can. Uh, I use it to cook with a lot. So this might be good to cook with. I don't know what I'd make with this. Uh, with uh, Foster's, I make uh, brats. I soak my brats and uh, fosters and uh, onions in the crock pot overnight after I've uh, seared them. It is fantastic. But anyways, um, I can't really think what else to compare to. Let's try again. Um, it's not bad. Uh, I wouldn't turn it away if you handed it to me. I'm not going to finish this one because I'm not into beer right now. But uh, yeah, it's not bad. Worth trying. I want to see what all the hype's about because I, I, I have a, a lot of this stuff that I unload weekly where I work. And uh, it's amazing how much I sell of this <laughs> particular beer. So I want to see what the hype was. Anywho, I hope you all are having a great or had a great weekend. And I hope you all have a great, great. Hey, sorry about that. We had a, we had a um, technical error on our recording device. So, uh, what I was trying to say is, hope you're having a good weekend, and uh, I'm sorry if you got to go to work tomorrow. I do. I have to work a double tomorrow, so enjoy that. Uh, so, when you're feeling crappy tomorrow, just remember that I have to do that. And then, uh, also, uh, you know, I hope you all uh, have a good week, and uh, thank you for subscribing, and thank you for liking, and if you haven't yet, please do so when you have 10 minutes, because everybody and their brother's on their phone, especially when they're in the bathroom. We know who you are. Run through the, sh run through the show. You don't even got to watch them. Just tag them, subscribe, like them. All of it helps. And we're still trying to get to that number there to get the uh, special surprise I'm going to do for you guys. Well, you know what the surprise is. Let's get it going. Let's get it cracking. Tell all your friends. I can't help. My, I'm just not good on technical today. I'll tell all your friends and family that if you want to have a good laugh or learn something about some alcohol or try see someone try something you want to try, Tell them to subscribe for me as well as for you because the more subscribers I get, the more sponsors we get, the more sponsors we get, the better the shows because then we can get our new office and our new you know, studio and better stuff that we can put online and try and all that. And then I'm here for you as well as me. So let's get, let's do it together. As always, don't forget grinds.com. Check them out. You won't be sorry. 
I guarantee it. And until the next time, boys and girls, see you in the next one.